What is a downburst? We see people talking about it, but we went to the expert to figure out what it is. So the activity that we saw overnight, Chris, yeah. a downburst was a part of that. Yeah, downburst, microburst, it's got a few different names, but it's just this burst of downward air that uh, resulted in some really strong winds. So a lot of folks wanna know how this happens. We're gonna walk you through step by step. You see that rising motion in the atmosphere that eventually forms a storm. The air cools and condenses, and you get a lot of heavy rain, right? But what winds up happening with the storm is that upward motion is completely cut off. So once you choke that off, watch this animation, you just have this downward burst of very strong wind. So it can almost look like tornado damage, but a lot of your damage is fanning out. And what was kind of interesting is this was textbook. If you look at the radar, radar sites here, green is the air going toward, red is the air going away. So it was diverging like you would see in a downburst or a microburst. And then we got this picture right here from Kim and it goes to show that downward motion and kind of the outward motion too. This is a nightmare for aviation um, and it was a nightmare on parts of I-40 yesterday. You know, you kind of talked a little bit where some people might look at that one uh, image you showed, it looked like it's a funnel cloud. So, well, not quite, it's a little different. Yeah, it definitely is. I mean, wind is wind. It doesn't matter if it's coming straight or if it's rotating, it's gonna do damage. And in this case, it, uh, it was coming down. It, it looks scary whether it's a funnel or not. It does. <laughs> um, but it, it definitely producing damage, a lot of wind damage in uh, both Wake and Johnston counties yesterday. Okay, very cool. Interesting to know because I did see some people putting something online, so it's nice to know that there's actually a little reason behind it, which again, you said downburst or microburst. Exactly. All right, appreciate it, Chris. You got it.